My name is Todd Harms. I'm currently the fire chief of Metro Fire in Sacramento. I spent 30 years in Phoenix. That's where I started my career and worked my way up. The last five years that I was in Phoenix, I was one of the board members uh, on the Arizona Burn Foundation and saw the very beginning of Milo and Moxie when I was leaving. The foundation was looking at a new way of getting out to really the, the schools, knowing that that population are, are at very high risk. Mick offered up an opportunity for us to be one of the out of Arizona sponsors. We were struggling with uh, really getting back into the schools. What were we going to deliver? Our community involvement group uh, took a look at the program of Mile on Moxie and we're very impressed. The foundation in Phoenix has just been uh, tremendous in supporting us in materials. The group came up and put on a train the trainer program up here. We reached out to 200 uh, preschools in our area here and right away we got a response from 70 of them set up meetings and in October we we hit about 2,500 kids just with our initial rollout we have a goal of hitting 10,000 kids during the spring of 2020 one of the teachers that is just working like mad every single day loved that everything was self-contained there was material there was a learning book there was a reading book everything was delivered in together again the rollout uh, because of the support of the foundation uh, was very easy i think most people like a like a dog and they like a bird and and the ability to sit down and, and tell a story and then being able to hold their attention with something that they're looking at and they're connecting with i'll be honest i think having firefighters there with the with the uniform with the kids they they, they enjoy that interaction we'll never be able to put maybe a number to it but you know what you're doing will have a positive effect out there that uh, really we're eliminating 911 responses. I'm just so happy to be really what I would say in on the, on the ground level of this expansion outside of Arizona. I suspect in, in a few years I'll be at some conference somewhere and, and someone will be standing up there talking about Milo and Moxie and how they adapted to it. And I'll have a big smile on my face because I know exactly the heart and soul that went into the beginning of it, how it was developed, and then just you know the pride that you see uh, in two or three years from now of someone standing up there talking about the program and, and talking about the successes, their own successes of uh, across this nation.